Hi, in this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to open your iTunes, import the media, as well as log into this account. It's pretty quick. Prior to that, you can see iTunes Quick Tool. I just want to leave it for yourself to understand. Here, you can see the devices once it is installed, but in my case, none of the devices got activated. You can sign in with this Apple ID to get most from the iTunes. That we are going to do a little bit of this video. You can see the albums over here. You can click an album to see more songs on it. Or you can even go to see all your music. So that's the latest version. I'm going to next. It also shows that millions of songs at any time. You can see the playlists and albums are recommended for you. You can also see a new and latest hits. Listen to later. So lots of information. Your modern day mixtape. You can create your own playlist. To have a perfect mix for your rhythm. You click the playlist to get started. Add more and more to your playlist. You can customize yourself. Or you can use this plus button at the bottom to create or edit a new playlist. It also provides what's up next. What's up playing next. You can drag that just by placing it over here you can change even the songs order it's pretty good all the fly can change your songs there is a radio tailored for you so ready to play stations bring you the music it's a great add-on tons of radio stations already added over here click next you can also click itune store to buy new music the purchasing has been made so simple through this it's a smaller one, yet it will be providing a lot of powerful features. You can click on the art to open a mini player. In the iTunes itself, you can control your playlist like pause, next, backward, even sound. So it's really great. In the last, you can discover, play and enjoy. This ends the tour slideshow. I'm just closing it down. It's real fun. The next step is to Log in to my ID, provide your credentials, Apple ID and password, click sign in. Once you are connected, you can drop down over there to see the details and other stuff that you are logged in. Let me quickly walk through this menu file. It has a new playlist, smart playlist. You can see add files to the library, library. Organize your library, exporting, importing the playlists, the devices that you have connected to. You can synchronize them, backup and restores from backup. So sharing, turn on home sharing, create new version. I'm not going for this. And other stuff is pretty easy like print and page setup. In edit you can see a common features like undo, redo, stuff that you do in this. In view you can see a music, movies and other stuff from here you can organize most of them or through thumbnails in this so either ways you can choose you can also go with the mini player that we were discussing in the quick tour you can also check up your equalizer to change according to your needs going to the control it's pretty simple play pause next to previous increasing the volumes decreasing getting the audio subtitles shuffle repeat most of the other stuff in the store you can see mostly you need to connect to internet and follow up all this stuff. In help there are a lot of guides according to specific requirements. Thanks for watching this video. In our next video we'll show you how to connect your devices to this iTunes and how it appears. Thanks for watching this video. This is Kiran signing off. Have a good day. Bye.